slide is the total summary of the video. It actually shows how a compressor based dehumidifier works, how a humid, how the humid air get converted into dry air and what are the function of different component of dehumidifier be it the evaporator coil, condenser coil, extract fan or compressor. So in coming slides, we'll understand everything in detail. Hi, welcome to Control Technology. Today we will understand how dehumidifier works. So before that, let's understand what is a dehumidifier. In short, dehumidifier is a device that extracts the moisture from the air. You often find these devices in home or any industrial places, commercial places. In short, dehumidifier is used to create a dry air and many applications need the climate with very low humidity. In such places, dehumidifiers are used. Please note that based on the working principle, there are mainly two types of the dehumidifier. The first is called a desiccant dehumidifier, which uses a absorbent material like silica to remove humidity from the air. And the second most commonly used compressor dehumidifier. This dehumidifier uses condensation method for the dehumidification. Condensation dehumidifier are also called as a compressor dehumidifier or refrigerant dehumidifier. And in this session, we are going to discuss the working of condensation dehumidifier only. To understand condensation dehumidifier working principle, let's first understand what is condensation is. When humid air comes in contact with cold surface, and if the temperature of the cold surface is less than the dew point of the air, then the moisture present in the air get converted into the liquid water droplets. For example, in summer, when there is a hot and humid climate outside and you run air conditioner at night inside your home, morning you find water drops on window glass. It is because of condensation of moisture available in the air outside air and this is the condensation condensation dehumidifier uses same principle to remove humidity from the air so to understand the working of compressor dehumidifier you need to understand what 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 are the component in it it has a body casing which house all the uh, all all the components it has an evaporator coil where the actual condensation happens. Then it has a condenser coil which used to reheat dry and cold air, cold air. And it has a compressor which is the heart of the refrigerant cycle. It used to increase the increase the pressure of the gas. The refrigerant gas enters into the compressor with the low pressure and the low temperature and, and leaves the compressor with the high pressure and the high temperature gas. Then it has extract fan. Extract fan is used to pull the air, air, humid air into the dehumidifier. And it has a condensate tank, which used to uh, collect the condensate water. These all component constitute the dehumidifier. After gathering this all basic information, now we are ready to understand actual how dehumidifier works. So we'll understand it step by step. Let's go. So let's understand step one. When users start dehumidifier, the extract fan starts working. So it will pull the humid air from the room into the dehumidifier, inside the dehumidifier. And then this humid air subject to the, subjected to the process of removing the humidity from it. So in stage two, actual condensation happens. At this stage, humidity from the air is removed. So here, please note that due to the refrigeration cycle, evaporator coil becomes very cold. 
and its temperature becomes less than the dew point of the humid air. So in short, it has a very, very cold surface. When humid air from the room is passed over the cold surface of the evaporator coil, then the moisture present in the humid air get condensed in the form of the water droplet and it get accumulated on the evaporator coil. This process is called as a condensation and in this stage actual moisture from the air get removed in terms of the water droplet. In this stage water which condensed on the evaporator coil surface get accumulated into a tank which is called as a condensed tank. And when the tank get full, dehumidifier gives the tank full indication and asks the user to empty the tank. And also at the same time, it stops working to avoid the overspilling of the water. Also, mini dehumidifier has a facility to connect the hose pipe for the continuous drainage to avoid emptying of the tank frequently. As we saw in the stage two, during the condensation process, dry air get generated. But this dry air is very, very cold and it is not suitable to release very cold air back into the room. Hence, it passed over the hot condenser coil to heat the air back to the room temperature so that a uh, room climate is comfortable. So far as what we saw from the stage 1 to stage 4 is the one cycle of the dehumidification. This is the process of converting the humid air into the dry air. And this process just repeated into the loop to feed the dry air into the room continuously. User can set the required humidity level from the control panel of the dehumidifier. And the humidity stat of dehumidifier keep checking the humidity level of the intake humid air and when it detects that the humidity of intake humid air is less than the set value then it, it stop, stop working compressor and the fan. At the same time when it detects that humidity level of the intake air is higher than the set value it starts, starts the compressor and the fan automatically and this ensures the automatic operation of dehumidifier. We hope you understood working of the compressor based dehumidifier. In case you have any query, please write us. We will try our level best to clarify your queries and to see more such informative videos, please subscribe our channel. Thank you very much.